Georgia State. Hernandez hits a ground ball, double play chance, easily turned. He smoked a ground ball, but Sanders starts a 6-4-3 double play. Really more comfortable in that leadoff role where you would maybe ideally have Lockridge because of his speed, so you don't want to bump Matty. He's on a roll, so I think, think you're right. They're trying to find a comfort zone for Lockridge. 2-2. Two -two. That's a ground ball right side. Scoots through for a base hit. Sanders will round third. Pagan's throw home is late. And the Trojans have tallied an early run here against Channing Walker. It's just two dollars gets everybody in. Runner goes, line drive, base hit right field. It's beautiful to see the hit and run work. Scoring is Frederick, pulling it at third is Lockridge. Two to nothing, Troy. Driven in 31 runs this year. Vasquez throws and it's lined into right field base hit. One run is in. The throw will go to second. Two runs are in. Joey Dennison has cashed in with a two-run single to post Troy to a four-zip lead. Just continues to produce runs. 33 RBIs on the year. Came in second in the league at 31, and that'll push him closer to the top. Two runs with a single. Hits another shot. That'll be a base hit into left. Boy, pitch must look like a beach ball to him. Now Frederick's caught between uh, bases, but he'll get in uh, to third safely. He pulled up between second and third. Hunter Phillips kind of froze, and then uh, when uh, Frederick breaks to third, the throw goes. Breaking pitch is ripped. That's got a chance. That'll get through. It'll score one run. They will wave Dennison around third. The throw is off the mark. He will score, and Prestigar delivers a two-out, two-run single into right for his 18th and 19th uh, runs, and the Trojans push their lead out to 7-1 now. That'll get, to, get us to the top of the order. Joseph Estrada, who takes a quick strike from Leitze. Estrada led off the game with a walk. Was cut down on a fielder's or on a double play, actually. Takes another quick strike. Boy, Leitze throwing BBs at the knees right now. 0-2. He singled and was stranded at third in the third inning. Down in the count now to Leitze, 0-2. Breaking pitch, swung on and, well, check that, that's a fastball. Swung on and missed, had some movement at the end, and he wow. hits Estrada on three. It's o'clock game in Thursday evening here. There's a hard hit ball. That's got a chance down the left field line. A fair ball into the corner. Be an extra base hit here for Chase Smart, who will lope around uh, first and pull up at second base with a leadoff double here in the fifth inning. And you just take. There's a hard hit ball. That'll be a base hit into right. That'll drive in a run. Early uh, gets an RBI here as uh, Smart comes in to score easily. Three straight hits, and the Trojans are up 8-1. to one. I don't want to leave out Manning early and what his impact could be on this lineup. He's just a freshman. That one's hit hard into the gap in left center field. That's got a chance. It will be off the wall, off the base of the wall. Locker just thinking three. He's going to turn on the Jets. Throw will come into third, but not in time. Another triple for Brandon Lockridge. And the Trojans in business here with a leadoff triple in the sixth. Barry, we're going to get a scoring change on uh, Smarts. That error will be changed to a hit. The reasoning is nobody was on the bag, so if the pitcher makes the play, there's still nobody okay. to uh, get the out. So give him his third hit of the game. Swing and a miss, a foul tip of the plate. Smart hangs on, two strikeouts. Thomas nods and throws, swing and a miss. Got the fastball, couldn't do anything with it. Levi Thomas strikes out the side in the seventh. At the stretch, Trojans nine and Hornets one. Against this Trojan pitching staff. Three, two, rip down to the right field corner. It's a base hit, right chasing for it is Pagan. Here come two runs, Dennison to third. Kofer has delivered a two run single here in the seventh inning to expand the Trojan lead to 12 to one. First baseman, 230 pounds plus. Pitch to him is hit up the middle, has a chance. The second baseman gets to it, flips to the shortstop, not in time, a run is in. That's a nifty play by Cheneau to get to a behind the bag and a backhand.